referee looks at his watch. Any second now. Hello, welcome back to Warm Bet TV. My name is Will. And I'm Tom. We're talking golf now. We are. The US PGA Championship. Thomas has done the research, so he's going to take us through what you need to know about the competition, who your choices are. Yeah. And he's off the back of a big win. Massive win last week, if you got on those. If you were on our WhatsApp group, so make sure you get on the WhatsApp group below. Save the number, message us, join on WhatsApp, and you'll be added to the group. You get all of our bets on there. Yes. All the research is on, uh, on YouTube. YouTube video. All the bets with enhanced odds are on our WhatsApp group. So add that, save the group, and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Perfect, admin done. So tell us what we need to know about the competition. Okay, so USPGA, it's the last major of the year. It's yeah. the fourth major of the year. Um, going to St. Louis, Missouri, mm -hmm. um, the Bell Reeve Country Club. Okay, nice. Um, okay, a few little things to bear in mind. Four of the last six champions of the US PGA have been American and won their last and won their first major. Okay. So I haven't picked that for all my tips, but I've got one that I think is a good shout for that. Right. So hasn't won a major yet and is American. Um, it's not crucial to be long off the tee. Don't need so to be a big hitter. You don't need to be one of the big hitters. They've played here a few times and none of the big hitters have won. So just bear that in mind. Okay. The last 27 major winners have all been inside the world's top 50. Mm -hmm. So I'd avoid a big outsider. Mm -hmm. Don't go there. And 11 of the last PGA winners have finished inside the top 28 places in the WGC Bridgestone right. last weekend. Okay. So, so you need to be in the top 28 at Bridgestone. Yep. Inside, inside the, the top, top 50, 50 ranked. Yep. And pretty much that's maybe American. And it's good if you've won already this season. 16 of the last 19 winners have won earlier this season. Okay. So I've used that logic to get my people. Yeah. So yeah, Will mentioned it before, last weekend at the WGC Bridgestone, Great picks. I picked four people out and they all finished inside the top 40. Um, I picked Justin Thomas who won it at 25 to one if you got on that. Unbelievable. And then Thorborn Ollison finished third and I said go each way with him and that came in too. He was at 50 to one. He was 50 to one. Decent. So you'd have got a quarter or a fifth of yeah. his odds. So. I'm in good form. Hence why you need to be on the WhatsApp group. Exactly, so I'm in good form. So, um, those, are, those are my, that's the rationale of yeah. who, why I would pick them, and this is why I'm in good form. So, first pick, quite a few people won't be picking this guy because he's not in the greatest of form. Right. But not in the greatest of form for him. Okay. Okay, so it's Jordan Spieth. He's 16 to one with Bet Victor, our partner. Basically, since finishing second in the Masters in 2014, he's won a major one in every six he's played. Mm -hmm. Unbelievable strike rate mm -hmm. in a major. So even though he's not playing very well, he's dangerous yeah, yeah. in a major championship. He was ninth in last month's Open, so mm -hmm. did well. Um, and basically, I picked him based on his price. So his form isn't the greatest, but, but great odds. he's amazing at the um, Do you know how he did at it the majors. Yeah. Uh, didn't, do that well. didn't do that well, okay. but 16 to 1, is whenever, is, whenever Spieth is above 10 or 12, yeah. I'll pick Spieth, because yeah. 16 to 1 is a good one to go. So, next one is Justin Rose, yeah. Englishman. So he's the world number two, yeah. has five top 10s in his last five tournaments, including a win. So he's already won this year. Great form. And is in great form. He didn't play last weekend at the WGC Bridgestone. But prior to that, his form has been incredible. He'll be fresh. So I think he's going to be fresh. At 20 to 1, he is very, very Good tasty odds. at this. Okay, so that's the, sec uh, the second one. The third is my American pick who hasn't won a major yet. Okay. And I would oh, say yeah. is Shout. probably my dark horse for this one. So it's Tony Finau. So he's at 40 to 1. He's the only player in the previous three majors this season to finish in the top 10 in all of them. The mm. only player in the whole tournament. So it's tour. coming. It's coming. He's been doing it. So he fits the criteria of what you said earlier. He fits every single American criteria. American who hasn't run, American run a major. Hasn't won a major yet. Finished inside the top, finished tied 10th for the WGC. Yeah, he's looking good. He's in good. the world top 50. 
and needs a good finish to secure his Ryder Cup spot. My shout. I'll be, I'll be backing him. He's the one that I would pick. 40 to 1. At 40 to 1, do him each way. He is definitely worth a double, yeah. uh, Tony, for now. Um, and then my final one, I like picking this guy in majors because he often does well, mm -hmm. is Mark Leishman, the Australian. He's 50 to 1. Yeah. He was 13th at this event last year. So he likes, he likes this event. He was ninth at the Masters earlier this year in one of the majors and was in contention at the WGC Bridgestone last weekend but fell away in the last Had round. Had a bit of a stinker, did Had he? a bit of a stinker in the last round. I think he dropped four shots in the last six holes. Right. But up until then, he was He's flying. There. He was about fourth or fifth. Right. So he fits pretty much the criteria, not American, but in the top 50, yeah. has already won this year and did well at the WGC. 50 to one, Mark Leishman. Those are my four, four picks. Four good picks. Those are my four picks. Are we going Tony for now? I think oh, he's no. he's probably, at those odds, I would say he's very good each way, but get a little bit on Spieth. At yeah. 16 to one, go Spieth on the nose. Maybe Worth don't do maybe do not do Spieth each way. Do for now each way and Spieth on the okay. nose. Okay, lovely. Like Let's it. see if Tom can get two Come on. competitions out of two on the old golf. That would be good. Uh, I've got a good feeling I have about to. that. And the form that you've been in has actually been decent. Golf, I've been doing very, very well. So we'll listen to him. Get on it if you want. Join our WhatsApp group. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. And we'll be previewing all the other sports coming up. So we'll see you later. See you later. Good luck. Now then, this. Okay, the referee looks at his watch. And his second now.